Hi, Mr. Ellis. This is Stephen. How are you doing today? Okay. That's wonderful. Glad to hear that.、Uh, my name is Stephen Smith. I'm getting back to you. We spoke to you last week. You told me that you can call me back. Do you remember that? No. Let me give you a quick recap.、Uh, the reason of this call is to inform you that you are qualified for a new state-regulated final expense program, and it is designed to oh, cover. Oh no, I'm not interested. It is not insurance, ma'am. You don't have to buy anything. Due to this COVID and pandemic situation. The state of Kentucky has been recently approved some additional discounts and benefits for those people who do have already a plan in place, and for those people who are on social security, disability, low income, or fixed income. So what we're gonna do? We will provide you the codes first. Educate yourself. If you like something, you can think about it and get back to us in the future. If you don't like something, there will be no cost from your side. Okay? And Miss Alice, you sound pretty young. How old are you? Seventy-three. Seventy-three. You don't sound like that. What's your secret, by the way? I thought you would be in your fifties. <laughs> yeah, and, I wish. And at this age, do you have high blood pressure or diabetes? Not that I know of. I wish you a very good health. And as I mentioned, that it is not a sales call. Listen to the information. Check out the benefits what state is offering you. If you like something, you can think about it. So the state is providing you the information on three different plans. The lowest one is of one to five thousand. The medium one is of ten to fifteen, and the higher one is of twenty to twenty-five. Would you like to check out the information on all the plans, or just the lowest one would be all right? I've already checked out one this year. Sir, it is,、uh, ma'am. It is for those people who do have already a plan in place. So just check out the benefits. You don't have to buy anything. I mentioned that it is not a sales call. It is just a code. That's it for your future references. How much is it you bought this year? It's a big one, a fifty thousand or a smallest one, ten thousand. Ten. Ten. And how much you are paying for you that monthly? Yeah, almost eighty. Eighty dollars for ten thousand. Yeah, it's pretty expensive. But the plan I'm talking yeah, about is a final expense program, and the state specially designed this for those people who do have already a plan in place, and for those people who are on social security, disability, low income, or fixed income. So right now, educate yourself. Have an apple to apple comparison. You know that there is a big difference between the old things and the new things. In case if you like the rates, like the discounts. You can call us back in the future. If you don't like something, there will be no cost from your side. Okay. So you want to switch around? Get old. You don't have to <laughs> change anything. So you want to check out the information on the ten one, or just the lowest one would be all right. No, I'm not going to go with it right now. So you don't have to buy anything. I mentioned that. You don't have to make any decisions. Just have an apple to apple comparison with your policy. If you like something, you can think about it. That's it. The lowest one is of one to five thousand. The medium one is of ten to fifteen, and the maximum one is of twenty to twenty-five. Which plan would you like to check out the information on? Any rough idea? Well, it's going to cost you monthly, ain't it? Same as the others. I'm sorry. Can you repeat that again? It does cost you monthly the same as all the others, right? But not right now. Right now, it is just a code. We are just telling you the discounts, the prices, and the benefits we have for you. That's it. So I'm just telling you that、I、have an apple to apple comparison with your balls. You have a ten thousand dollar. So just check out the information on the ten thousand plan. If you like something, you can discuss with your family and get back to us. If you don't like something, no one is going to bother you again. That's it. So you want to check out the information on the ten to fifteen thousand coverage plan, or just the lowest one, one to five? Lowest one is doing no good.、Uh, lowest one? That's the lowest one. Wouldn't do no good because your funerals cost more than that. <laughs>、uh, we have the lowest one is for cremation, which is one to five thousand. The medium one is for funeral and burial, which is ten to fifteen. And the higher one is for those people who want to leave some extra tax-free money for the loved ones as a gesture of goodwill. 
So you want to check out the information on the medium plan or the higher one? So you can tell me what it would cost monthly on the higher one? Okay, the higher one. And you also qualify for some additional discounts and benefits as well if you're a non-smoker by nature. Do you smoke or not? No, I don't, but I have COPD. Okay, I'm so sorry about that, but you still qualify for this program. Because in this plan, the age health issues, the health issues doesn't matter. And the rates will remain the same till the rest of your life. And I do believe that you have a life insurance, right? Yeah. Okay, so let me tell you the difference between life insurance and final expense. In life insurance, God forbid something happens to me right now, my beneficiary will get the money after 60 to 90 days, which is a long time period. Final expense is a cash policy. It is a day one coverage plan. God forbid something happens to me right now, my beneficiary will get the money on the same day, in the next 24 hours. And in life insurance, if you got some major health issues like COPD, uh, dementia, Alzheimer's, the rates and cost going to go up to $100 a month, and it will get expired when you reach at the age of 75. But in final expense, if you got some major health issues, the premiums will be locked for the rest of your life, and it will never get expired. And the most advantage of this final expense is that, the beneficiary will get the double amount. Like if you have a 5000 let's suppose you are talking about the 25000 If you have a $25,000 policy, the beneficiary will get 50 grants. So I respect that you have already a plan in place. We will provide you the information on the higher plan, 20 to 25. And Miss Alice, one last thing, when is your birthday? Well, you are in 1949. Uh, 1949. And what is the month? February the 19th. February the 19th. Mine is December the 11th. I'm a Christmas baby. <laughs> oh. Yeah. And what is the year? 1949? Right. Okay, and you are still residing in the state of Kentucky, 41041, right? Right. Okay, so Miss Alice, all is done here. I will not put you in a long hole. Now it's time to provide you the codes on 20 to 25,000 coverage plan. Uh, let me introduce you to my quality specialist. He will just take a few seconds to re-verify the same information, just to make sure I didn't miss anything. You know that we all are human beings and we do make mistakes, right? Nobody's perfect. He will quickly verify the details and pass the call with the license agent so you can listen to the information on 20 to 25,000 coverage plan. And after that, if you like something, you can think about it. If you don't like something, you can stay wherever you are right now, okay? okay. And I will introduce you by myself. How long have you been in Kentucky? All of your life? Oh, well. yeah. oh it's a big number, though. <coughs> That's wonderful. Agent 02 on the recorded line. Who do I have? Uh, Miss Alice, let me introduce you. Hi, sir. I have Miss Alice Dolin with me from the state of Kentucky. 41041 is the zip code. She's 73 years young. February 19, 1949 is the date of birth. No major health issues, just COPD. And want to check out the information on 20 to 25,000 coverage plan. Uh, Ms. Alice, he will quickly verify you and pass the call with the license agent so you can listen to the information easily. Over to you, sir. Thank you. Uh, hi, ma'am.